Welcome to Photoshop Lab. Let's start this by adding a new layer for our background. Use brush tool. I am using the default swatches included in the swatches tab. You can play around. Then convert the layer into a smart object. Go to filter, blur, Gaussian blur. Set the blur up to 180 to 190. Then grab your subject. So remove the background using the selection tool. Adding mask, convert it into black and white. Hit OK. Then convert to smart object. Drag it to your project. Control plus T to resize or to use transform tool. We drag another image for the background. Place it again under the image layer or the photo. Set the blend mode into color dodge or linear dodge. Lessen the opacity. Then drag the last image for our background. Control T to resize it or to open transform tool. Use blend mode. You can uh, use screen or soft light. Lessen the opacity. Let me organize my layers for a while. Then add a gradient map. Create a clipping mask and clip it above the main image or main subject. You can copy my gradient setting here or you can come up with your own colors or a color setting or a gradient setting. Add the text. For the text effect, open the text layer or the layer style. Copy my setting. The setting can be tweaked or can be revised based on the size and style of your font or text. Hit OK. Then set the fill of the text into zero. Place it below the main subject layer. Resize it if you want. Duplicate it. Control plus J. Then there you have it. Allow me to edit some things for a while. Flatten the layers, Control shift alt plus E, then convert it into smart object. After this, you can play around by adding or using different adjustment layers and adding some noise to your final product. And that's it. Once again, thank you so much for watching our tutorial.